Hello, sir. I'm so sorry about the last class. The internet, there is some sort of problem. Oh, okay. That's okay. No problem. We missed you, but that's okay. You can watch the video. <laughs> yes. Uh, okay, good. So, how is everybody doing today? Fine. Good. Good. Uh, let's meet everyone. <clears throat> um, so, Arasandi. Hello. Hi, how are you? I'm fine. Um, I'm sleepy. Huh? I'm fine, but I'm, I feel so sleepy. Sleepy? Oh, where are you? Where, where do you live? I live in Indonesia. Ah, well, it's morning there, so... Yeah. Yes, and what city in Indonesia do you live? I'm in Samara. Okay. Great. And what do you do? I'm studying. Study at Polygon University. Okay. And what, what subject do you study? I take um, Indonesian literature. Indonesian literature. Interesting. Hmm. Yes. Cool. And okay, so and how old are you? I'm twenty years old this year. Mhm. Mm and I'm just gonna do some. I'm just gonna ask a lot of questions to everyone because this is a beginner conversation class. So I'm gonna talk to everyone here for a long time. It'll get our conversation going. Um and okay. um. What about your family? Uh, do you live close to your family? Yes, in Samarang I live in my boarding house. Mm -hmm. Actually, I live at Pati. That's about uh, seventy kilometers far from Samarang. Mm -hmm. And I have, I have one of my sisters in Samarang too. My mom's in Pati, and my dad in. In another city in Chapara. Hmm. Mm hmm. So you have father, mother, sister. How many do you have? Any how many sisters and brothers do you have? I don't have any brothers. I just have one sister. <laughs> okay, so you just have the one sister. Oh, okay. Okay. Great. Uh, what else can I ask? Um, what is your favorite food? My favorite food is um, fried rice, mm -hmm. fried chicken, and also a meatball, like meatball. a beef. Yes. Mm -hmm. Like Indonesian style? Or yes, Indonesian style called bakso. Ah, uh, okay. Okay, interesting. Good. Uh, okay, what else? Uh, what else can I ask? Um, what did you do last weekend? I'm um, doing nothing. I have my performance. Performance my for stage. Performance yeah. for what? A poetry performance. Poetry? Dancing. Yeah. Oh, dancing, dancing too. Dancing with the poetry. Dancing like with poetry. Like a theater. Yeah. Theater. And mix it with music. With wow. a traditional, traditional music. Yeah. And wow. contemporary dance. Cool. That's interesting. <laughs> That's awesome. So you were uh, pr practicing? Yes, I practicing. And when is your performance? Uh, at I forget. <laughs> <laughs> you don't know when? Uh, at 16, maybe, 16 June. Uh, 16 July, you mean? No, no, 16 June. That's pass away. Oh, so you already had the performance? Yeah. Oh, okay, but you're still practicing? Yeah. Okay. I have a next performance. Oh, you have another two one? Two weeks. 
Oh, in yes. two weeks. That was my question. Yeah, in two weeks. Okay. All right. Well, good luck on that. Uh -huh. Thank you. <laughs> uh, okay. So we'll keep going here. Let's meet everyone else. Uh, Daniel? Hello, teacher. Hey, how are you? I'm fine, thanks. And you? I'm um, good. So where are you from? I'm from Colombia. Colombia. What city? Uh, my department is Huila, but I live in Pitalito. In where? Pitalito. Oh, I guess I don't know where that is. Uh, <laughs> and what do you do? Uh, I'm 17 years old, so <laughs> I'm in school. In school, yeah. No. Cool. Study in an institute systems. Oh, okay. Yes. Okay. And what about your family? Do you have many brothers and sisters? Or? Yes, actually, I have a brother and he is studying medicine in Argentina. Wow. That's a long way from home. Uh, and what about what is uh, what's your favorite food? In in my country, uh, we have a special food. Uh, I I don't I don't think that you know. Uh, we call the shona. It's called shona. The shona. Could you type it in the yes. calling out chat? Okay. Lechona. It's Let's... a kind of pig. Pig uh, with rice. It is delicious. I, I don't know how how to cook, but I love that. Okay, cool. And uh, so lechona, is it? It's pork with rice, is that it? Okay. Yes, I, I don't know exactly what is it, but okay. There's a lot of noise in your mic. I I I I'm not good. It's okay. It's just really hard to hear you. I can I can't hear your voice very much, but I can hear like breathing sounds more than your voice, and it sounds like the microphone is I don't know. It's just really hard to hear you. Let Jonah. Okay. okay. All right. So what else can I ask you? Um. And what did you do last weekend? Mm, let me see. Mm, I, I, watch, I was watching a, a movie. A movie? A movie? Which movie? Let me see. Uh, did you see uh, the call of... Da Vinci. What? Uh, code, code Da Vinci. Da oh, Vinci the Da Vinci code. code. The Da Vinci Code. Yeah. yeah. It was it good? Yes, because I I read a book about that, mm -hmm. so it is interesting. Okay. I, I enjoy so the movie. Great. I'll have to check it out sometime. I haven't seen it yet. Uh, okay, cool. Thank you. Welcome. Um, and Ed, you? Hello. Hello. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. And you? Yeah, it's good. Good to see you again. Oh, thank you. Good to see you too. Yes, and do you want to tell everyone where you uh, where you're from and what you do? Okay, um, I am Edu Santos. I am from Brazil. I was born in Amazon forest, but I am living in southern Brazil now. I am a business administration student. I am 23 years old. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 
All right. <laughs> so let's keep going here. What about uh, tell me about your family, brothers and sisters? Um, my family is good, but so far I miss my family. Oh, are they all very much? The Amazon again? Are they still in the Amazon? Yes. <coughs> Sorry. I see. Okay. So, how often do you get to see them? What? How often do you get to see them? Your family. You see them every year. Uh. uh yes. Uh. Two two. Two times. Two times per year? Yeah. Okay. Well, that's not bad. Sometimes that's all I get to How see. How to my... say two times? You can say two times per year. Let's see. I'll say. <coughs> okay. Or. Um, it's actually it's very common to say two times okay. a year. Same thing. Two times a year. Ah. Okay. And Thank you. you have many brothers and sisters? I have two brothers. Two brothers. Okay. All right. Yes. All right. So, what else here? Um, I was going to ask you about your favorite food. Okay, my favorite food: um, pasta, fish. Um, like mango, strawberry, mm, yes. banana, lots of yeah, food. and tacos. Ah, tacos. Um, Mexican Mexican food. Tacos. Yeah, real Mexican tacos are really good. And uh, if you've ever been to the United yeah. States, we have really bad tacos in the United States. But sometimes you can find really good Mexican tacos. <laughs> that are really good. Like I was in. Uh, Austin, Texas, last week, and I had one of the best tacos I've ever had. It was a real Mexican style taco, and it was fantastic. I wish the real I wish tacos in America always tasted like that, but not usually. Um, <laughs> oh, what okay. else? And then, what did you do last weekend? Um, I studied very much, mm -hmm. and I. I worked a lot. I met new people in my university. And yeah, is this Okay. Cool, cool. Well good to talk to you. Good to see you again. Uh okay, Thank so you. uh Milton. Oh he just I just said his name and he went away. It's bad. Okay, let's try again. Um Ricardo. Okay, hi teacher, how are you? I'm good, how are you? I'm fine, my first class with you. Oh really, welcome. Really. So tell me about yourself. Oh, Ricardo, are you still there? Or... Looks like you may be frozen, maybe your internet is slow because I cannot hear you. Let me go back to you because I think you have a problem. Um, Samantha. Yeah, hi. Can you make it louder? I can't hear you. Oh, just a, just a second. Okay. I will try to, to, to fix them. Now it's better? Uh, a little. It's just very quiet. It's hard to hear your words. So just try to speak loudly. Um, so, hi, how are you? I'm fine. Great, thank you. And where are you from? I'm from Brazil, too. Aha. Uh -huh. And which city? Sao Paulo. Sao Paulo. And what do you do? Um, I work with events. I am an uh, event coordinator. Mm -hmm. Yep. Okay. Good. And uh, so let's see. How old are you? I'm 
36 years old uh -huh. and I have one child. I have a son. Oh, okay. Cool. How old is your son? He is eight. eight oh, okay, years. great. great. And what's your favorite food? Oh, my favorite food is lasagna. I oh. love lasagna. Uh huh. Another Brazilian who likes pasta. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. And what did you do last weekend? I stay at home and watch a lot of films. <laughs> cool. Good. All right. Cool. So um, let's continue here. Um, Ricardo, are you back? Yes, teacher. I uh, as soon as I start to talk to you, my connection I lose my connections. <clears throat> uh, okay, so uh, we'll try again. Uh, where do we start here? Let's see. You are um, so Ricardo. Where are you, where are you now? Uh, I'm from Brazil. I live in Campinas. Campinas. And I am musician. And I've seen a keyboards behind you. I guess you you play something. Yeah, I'm also a musician. Yep. Yeah. yeah. Oh, cool. <laughs> yeah. uh, you are a musician and an English teacher. <laughs> uh, yes, musicians. Musicians don't usually make that much money, so I need to do lots of other things to make money. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, it is. Uh, at least for now. Oh, okay. Uh, uh, we have the the same problem here in Brazil. <laughs> Yes, uh, I play acoustic guitar and I sing. I I play in bars and and parties, but I right now I'm student in the the college uh, marketing for maybe uh, uh, some years. Uh, uh, in the future, can I uh, apply in my uh, school music? I I intend to to have a, a school. Uh, for me. Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. Um, so you play guitar and sing, or acoustic guitar and sing in bars? Yes. I okay. play bass, bass guitar too. And you play bass too, oh, okay. Bass, bass guitar, yes. I play drums and guitar and piano and sing. Oh. Um, oh. Yeah, and actually, I actually teach music classes on Colingo. Really? Oh. Yeah, if you check my schedule, actually this will be a good time for me to take a break and uh, <laughs> send everyone links, okay? So here's the Colingo Facebook group. I just posted it. Um, and we also have my my uh, Facebook page for or my teacher page. And then we also have um, here you can follow all of the teachers on Colingo, and you can see our schedule, okay? And you can find that I teach different classes, including I teach music classes on there. Oh, uh, very so interesting. That's, and that's why I have the keyboard here right now, because I was playing it on some of my classes. Sometimes I'll play guitar, sometimes I'll show videos, but yeah, we do music. Here. Oh, you you teaching uh, uh, playing uh, alive? You mm -hmm. you chose one song. You play and sing it and talk about the song. Yeah, sometimes. Oh, very interesting. Yeah, it's fun. We usually talk about music, about uh, different things, about genres of music or s instruments or theory or just anything. Something, but it's in English, so it's just working on English by talking about music. Yes, I I've seen a lot of things in the internet about the the vocal techniques. In, I, I I guess in the United States, in one of the most uh, country, we, uh, you have the a lot of information about uh, vocal techniques. Mm hmm. Mm, okay. Yeah. Well, it's, it's music is a big thing here. Yes, I agree with you. Yeah. Uh, all right, and I was going to ask you, I've been asking everyone the same questions, so I was going to ask you how old you are and about your, if you have a family and stuff like that. Okay, I am 37 years old. Uh, I am married. Uh, my mother and my 
my dad uh, the best way, and unfortunately, um, and I have two dogs. Uh, they are like a, a child for me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, so no children. No, and my wife uh, uh, already had two, 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 wow, two nice. children. <laughs> ah, okay, yeah, yeah, I see. Cool, cool. Uh, all right, and I am stepfather. The... Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay, yeah, I understand. And what's your favorite food? All the foods. <laughs> <laughs> I I like to eat. Uh, you 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 can see me. <laughs> I'm a little fat, <laughs> but I I like pizza. I like uh, rice and beans. I like meat. Uh, this is uh, my favorite food. Okay, great, cool. And what did you do last weekend? Uh, I I played I played uh, Friday, uh, I sorry Thursday Friday and Saturday. Oh, okay, wow, very busy. Yes. Okay, cool, great. Let's uh, thanks. So welcome and let's keep going. Um, Sebastian. Uh, hello, teacher. How are you? Good. How are you doing today? Uh, I'm a little tired. Because ah. I had a test today about the verb patterns at the university. Ah. Because I'm really, really tired. But I, I, I'm, I'm cool for today. <laughs> okay. But you look very tired today. <laughs> Me? Yeah. Well, yeah. No, this is my fourth no. class I just taught. So this, is my <laughs> this is my exciting face. Ah. <laughs> yeah. How are you, teacher? Ah, good, good, good. All right. Right. And you so want to have uh, a test about the patterns on uh, the present continuous, that kind of, of thing at the university. It was oh, no, sorry. no very difficult, but it was. I, I know how to describe this, but it was a little researcher. A little what? Researcher. Um, what? Research. Um, Elaborate, sorry. You have so elaborate. Mm, lower, no? Lowered? What? I'm not understanding you actually. Well, it was difficult. Yeah. <laughs> it was a little it was difficult. difficult. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because we have, we have to know about the phonemes. I, I don't know if you know that things. Phonemes. Phon have phonemes. You, phonemes. You, phonemes. Phonemes. Have you ever listened to it? Um, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm sure I learned all that stuff, or a lot of that stuff. Yeah. Uh, yeah, at one time or another. So things, yeah, phoning, yeah. Phonings. Yeah. Well, we talk about stuff like that in our in my pronunciation classes sometimes, actually. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Um, and uh, you want to tell everyone where you're from? Um, well, I'm Sebastian Paul. It's, uh, I'm from Chile. I'm studying translation, English, Spanish in a British university. Uh, I like music. I really love play guitar. I have a band, an indie band. Uh, we play in some pubs here. We really enjoy it, but the, the, the bad things that here, they don't pay to us. Because music here is just culture. It's not a work. They see you like a hobby. Mm. You know, if you know uh -huh. what I mean, because here the, the situation about music, artists, um, paint, just everything about art, they don't <laughs> pay you too much here. Uh -huh. yeah. It's not seem so like a work. Just the people see seems that feel like like a like a hobby. Mm -hmm. Right. Uh -huh. Wow. Wow. Uh -huh. <laughs> Yeah. Well, it's I mean, art. It's hard to make money from art anywhere in the world. Um, really? Oh yeah, yeah. I think I think that the United States is is easier than other countries in the world. Well, everyone wants to be an artist in the United States, so it's not that. Yeah, easy. it's the American dream. <laughs> yeah, so to be a successful artist is very hard. Not yeah. easy. Most people don't make money. At, you know, 
Yeah. What, what kind of music? music do you like, teacher? What kind of music? Yes. I like all. I like all kinds of music. The, anyway. For example. I mean, I like I like good music. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I like I just like um, music from all genres. Uh, yeah. So I just I just re I really don't have any restrictions. I just know if I like it or not. If it's good quality, then I like it. So, but I like you know, yeah, everything. Pop music, uh, rock music, classical yeah. music, jazz music, country music, indie music, electronic music, rap music, anything. It doesn't matter as long as it's good. Yeah, yeah. So. But I see you like a musician, so I think that you really, you, you really like all the kind of music to get more stuff to to study about the music. That kind of. Yeah, get more influences. Yeah, exactly. That's yeah. the word. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Yeah. All right. And so, what about how old are you? And what about your family? Do you have brothers? Well, I have 19 years old. I look younger. I look like a 15, <laughs> 15 guy. But I live with my parents until now because I want to move on the next year. Mm -hmm. um, that's I. I just live with my parents. As the all the children in the family because I have a, a sister, but she moved three months ago. So now the 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 only one, and it it, it feel great because the parents cons uh, focus on you every time, and they they give you money. Uh, so like <laughs> like a like a like a little child, you know. <laughs> Oh, but yeah. I like it, but I miss my sister too. Because mm -hmm. all, all of that, all my life with her, it was, I think that it was a little difficult to leave her. Mm. Yeah. yeah. I see. Yeah. Okay. And what's your favorite food? I really enjoy staying with my friends. Drinking Coke, um, eating some crisps. Eating what? Crisps. Crisps? Yeah, exactly. Crisps. I don't know if you, United States say that. Crisps or fr or or chips. Oh, French fries. Chips. Exactly. No, 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 no French fries. Just crisp. Or crisps. Chips. 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 Yeah. They say chips. Sorry. Uh, British. The British say. Crisps. Uh, yeah, exactly. In, in yes. Okay, so you you drink coke and eat chips. <laughs> yeah, really. This is my this is not my favorite food. It's not very, healthy, but very healthy. Not, <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna fight, fight with diabetes, <laughs> but I really enjoy. That's when I eat that. I really, which I really brings me some memories about when I'm with my friends. You know, having yeah. a good time. It's kind of, I, I really like this. Food. Yeah. All right, cool. And finally, what did you do last weekend? Oh, last weekend I went to a party mm -hmm. from my university. It was with guys from different different places in the world, you know, some English, some uh, Miami boys, <laughs> you wow. know, some green girls. Yes, yes, um, some Dutch people from Holland. Mm, wow! Uh, some Great. Germans. Where did you, know, you Where did you meet all these people? All from all. Uh, they're from the university. They oh, study. okay, okay. Awesome. That's mm -hmm. it, it's awesome because we share all the cultures, or all oh. cultures, sorry. And it's very funny because I teach teach them the the Chilean words. It's it's very funny. <laughs> <laughs> Interesting. Yeah, yeah. yeah. All right. Cool. Well, it's good to see you again, and welcome. Right. Um, okay. So, Ina. Yeah. Hello, everyone. Hello, teacher. Hi. Am I saying your name right? How do I say your name? Uh, my nickname is Ina. Ina. That's right. <laughs> okay. Okay. And is that your? What's your real name? Ina Yada. Ina Yada. Okay. Yeah, it's Great. a very Brazilian name. Uh -huh. <laughs> All right. And uh, so what city in Brazil do you live? 
Uh, I live in Recife, okay. it's on the coast. Uh -huh. Um, okay. I'm a nursing student. I'm 22 years old. And okay. I work as a trainee in a hospital. Okay, great. And what about your family? Do you have brothers and sisters? Or married? Or Unfortunately, I am an only child. Only I don't child. have any brothers or sisters. Ah. Uh, and my family is very small. Oh, okay. Um, yeah. I'm single. So. Mm -hmm. Okay. So not many people there in your family. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yes. Well, maybe someday you'll have your own family and you can have lots of children. <laughs> I hope that. I hope. <laughs> you'll be surrounded by family. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, and what about, um, what's your favorite food? Is there a specialty um, in Fiji? <laughs> I'm crazy for Brazilian food, mm -hmm. um, especially who are made with um, seafood, you know, um, fishes or oysters. Mm -hmm. I love uh, seafood. Yeah, yeah, me too. So I bet Hisife has really good seafood. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Excellent. That sounds good. I'm sorry for my, my voice. I I got a sore throat. So. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> it's a little uh, hard. I, okay. I can hear you fine. It sounds fine. No problem. Okay. And what did you do last weekend? Um, I went out with friends we went to the beach ah oh, nice very nice yeah. okay great um, and we have uh, Yomna is here hello Yomna hello hi again we're glad you're back I'm glad you made it back thank you and why don't you tell everybody about yourself where you're from what you do all that stuff Okay, I'm from Egypt. I'm 19 years old. I'm studying in the Faculty of Education, English Department. I'm going to the second year, and I just finished my exams. So it is a question, actually, finally. Aha. Uh -huh. Wow, exciting. Yeah. And, um, I have a brother and a sister. Brother and sister, okay. I am the youngest. The youngest? They are both, yes. Mm -hmm. They are both married and uh, both of them live in case A. Mm -hmm. So I'm kind of feeling lonely suddenly, you know, after ah. being my father and my sister, my, my mother, suddenly so they, they went. Wow, they all moved away to another country. Yes, that's oh. hard. Yeah, you must miss them. Do you ever go visit them in Saudi Arabia? No, not yet. But I will go to them soon. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Do they live in the same city or in different cities? In the same city. They ah. both leave me and go together. <laughs> what? Wow. That's not nice. <laughs> Strange coincidence. Yeah. Hmm. All right. So, uh, what's your favorite food? My favorite food, actually, I love eating many things. I love pizza, I love the seafood, and maybe the most uh, best food for me, the best food for me is the food I cook. Mm -hmm. Although it may not seem very good to others, but for me, I cooked it, so it's great. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> that's good. You need to have pride in your food. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Um, and what about last weekend? Uh, what did you do last week? Last weekend, um, I, as I said, I just finished with exams, so I went out with my friends. We had lunch, we went shopping, and I started uh, reading a new novel. Oh, okay. And uh, what novel is that? Do anything we even know? Uh, Agatha Christie, The mm -hmm. Murder of Rosa Croyd. Do you know it? Did you read it? 
Agatha Christie murder which one? Murder of uh, Rosa Croyant. Hmm. No, I don't think I've. No, I, I definitely haven't read it. But I've. Agatha Christie's pretty famous. So. Yes. Yes. Okay. Great. She's brilliant. Thank you. Cool. Excellent. All right. And then um, Nina has joined us. Hi, Nina. Hi. Hi. How are you? I'm fine. <laughs> and you? Good. Good. So, where are you? Uh, I'm from Brazil, São Paulo. Oh, okay, cool. And um, what do you do? I'm just, I'm a student. Mm -hmm. And what do you study? Um, I study to pass at one university. Uh-huh. Uh, uh you're studying to get into university? Yes. Or, okay, so you're in high school? Um, I have finished the high school. Okay. So you're in between, maybe? Uh, sorry, I can't... Uh, so are you not in university yet? You're looking to be in university? Yes. Okay. And I have 18 years old. Okay, okay. Great. And what else? So, what um, what about your family? You have family, brothers, sisters. Um, I have one brother, and he's uh more old than me. Older. Uh, we, yeah. Older. yeah. Um, just just him. I have just have him. Mm -hmm. And my father and mom. Yeah. yeah. Good. Um, what about your favorite food? Uh, I like all the food. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, it's, um, I like uh, especially uh, a pe uh, spice, spicy food. Spicy food, yes. Spicy food. Yes, me too. Um, and my descendant is South Korean, so okay. I eat a lot of Korean food. Ah, good. I love mm -hmm. Korean. Yes, excellent. And what about last weekend? What did you do last weekend? Uh, last weekend I just hang out with my friends and and mm -hmm. I go to church. <laughs> And okay. uh, <laughs> just it. <laughs> <laughs> cool. That's it. All right. Very good. And we keep having more people um, join us, leaving us, and joining us. <laughs> Maybe that means it's a boring class. I don't know. Maybe I don't know. No, no, it's not boring. <laughs> just talking. Maybe just people, it's on. shy. <laughs> Maybe. Just, just working on our conversation here. So, what about uh, Jonathan? Hello. Hello, how are you? I'm fine. Uh, it's very hard to hear you. Can you make it louder? Some moments. Can you hear me? Ah, much better. Thank you. Oh. Um, hello? Yes. What about you? Tell me about yourself. Okay, my name is Jonathan. I'm here from Brazil. Mm -hmm. And um, what else? I don't know. <laughs> what do you do? Uh, how old are you? I'm 20, uh, 21 years old. Mm -hmm. And what do you do? I'm working and, uh, and uh, study a lot. Oh, okay. Good. And what are you studying? I study a uh, civil engineer. Okay. Great. And what about uh, family, brothers and sisters? Yes, I have uh, one sister. Mm -hmm. I live in with my parents. Okay. Good. And what's your favorite food? 
My favorite food is French fries with Coke. What? Really? <laughs> yes, really. Yeah, and uh, rice and bread. I'm Brazilian. Rice and bread and meat. Uh huh. Ah, okay. So we have two people in the class that like French fries with Coke. Or actually, no, one is chips and Coke. We have Sebastian likes chips and Coke, and you like French fries. That's okay. Okay. Chips, chips and Coke. Yeah, that's slightly different. Yes. Yeah. Uh, okay. And what about last weekend? What did you do last weekend? My last weekend, I study a lot because I study every day, mm. and civil engineering is not easy. Yeah. And yeah. Uh, and I passed my and I passed the 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 last week with my parents. Oh, okay. Good. Okay. Excellent. Um. So. We also have Ahmed is here. Yes, yes, teacher. Hello. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. And uh, tell me about yourself. Okay, um, I'm Ahmed Hediwi. Um, I'm from Egypt. Um, I'm 21 years old. Um, I'm uh, studying the engineering, mechanical engineering, in uh, in the last year. Um, what else? So, what city is in Egypt? Uh, Alexandria. Okay, nice. And Thanks. Great. And uh, what about your family? Um, I am the um, oldest. Uh, I have uh, one brother and uh, one sister. Mm -hmm. Okay. One brother, one sister. That's me too. I'm exactly the same. I have, I'm the oldest. And I have one brother and one sister. <laughs> yes. And what is your favorite food? Food. Okay. Um. I uh, really I I like uh, all Egyptian food. Uh, but uh, I love uh, I like most uh, food is um, uh, rice and fish, mm -hmm. seafood, uh, generally, um, and fruits. Mm -hmm. Okay. Great. Excellent. And finally, what did you do last weekend? Yes, um, really my last weekend um, was my um, friend's wedding. So it was uh, very special for me. Uh, I was with I was um, <coughs> with my friends or in in this wedding party. So you said your friend had a wedding? Yes. Wow. Cool. That's awesome. Is, is that fun? Yeah, sorry? Was that fun? Did you have a good time? Sorry, I, I can't did tell you, this. Did you in, enjoy yourself? Was it fun? Yes, yes, of course. Cool. Excellent. All right, well, it's good to meet you. Nice to meet you. Yes. Um, uh, so, let's see, we have Kawe. Or, I don't know how to pronounce your name. De Silva. Is your microphone on? I can't hear you. Check to see if. Um, if oh, no, no, yes, yes. Yeah. How do I say your name? Uh, my name is Kawe. C A U E. Kawe. Yes. Okay. Uh, I'm 37 years old. Uh, I'm a physical therapist. Um, I live with my parents. I have one sister. Um, she is more, how can I say, younger than me. Yeah, younger. Yes. Younger. Um, what else? The last weekend I just work. I went to airport. Uh, to get my dad-in-law. To get your what? Sorry. Oh, to you went to the airport for what? Uh, can I say um, to uh, not not to get uh, my my dad-in-law oh. the last week. Yes, the last week uh, she yes she went to to USA. Uh, oh. 
in the the last week I went to to airport to get so you went to the airport to pick up your father-in-law yes 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 pick up that's one of those um, what do you call it phrasal verbs we have that a lot in English yes yes yes, yes. Yeah. you can say get to you can say get I got my dad at the airport or yeah. okay. mm -hmm. but pick up is the more common mm -hmm. all right um, so all right. What about your favorite food? My favorite food, um, I like pasta. Uh, generally, I like um, health foods, <laughs> <laughs> uh, like pizza. Uh, what else? French fries. Uh, and sometimes Coca Cola with Coca Cola. You know. Generally, uh, uh, I, I I eat uh, health foods. <laughs> it's not good. <laughs> uh huh. Yes. Well, it can be tasty. Yes. Yeah, yes. I know it's not good. You watch out. <laughs> yes. <laughs> uh, okay. So, and then you said last weekend is when you picked up your father-in-law. Uh, what else did you do last weekend? Um. Just work, yeah. Just work. <laughs> yeah, busy. Then. Just work, yes. Just work. Yeah. I'm not. A, I mean, I'm. I'm not a a, a a workaholic, but I the last week I just work. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no problem. I have those weekends too sometimes. Okay. Yes. Uh, okay. So have we think we finally talked to everyone now. Um. I guess I can talk about myself for a second. Um, my name is Anthony. I, well, I'll answer all the same questions. I'll be good. I'll say all the questions. So my name is Anthony. I live in Atlanta, USA, but I'm originally from Wisconsin, USA. My job, um, I, uh, I'm a musician and I'm a designer, and I like to teach English online. I do a lot of that now. I'm 33. I have a, I'm older than my brother and sister. I have a brother and sister. I'm the eldest. And um, favorite food. That's hard. Boy, I can tell you a couple of days ago I had one of the best meals of my life and it was uh, Persian. Persian food. It was a uh, shish kebab with hummus and baba ganoush and uh, great to use it was perfect. I like all food, um, but yeah, Persian food is good. Ethiopian food, Indian, uh, Viet Vietnamese are some of my favorites, and then tra and then real Mexican, food. Chinese. I'll just stop talking because I like food a lot. And um, what did I do last weekend? I went on a trip. I drove to Texas, and I drove back from Texas last weekend. A teacher? <clears throat> yes. What's the typical food there in USA? Because all, one, all I know is just McDonald's. <laughs> yeah, McDonald's. <laughs> um, I don't know, like meat. I don't know what we like. I don't even know how to answer that because because all, all the what the Americans eat is just tacos and Chinese food, McDonald's, <laughs> you know, Kentucky. Yeah, and we, that's no American, not American. Sorry. Well, actually, it kind of is because America, the uh, United States, is a melting pot of all different cultures. Oh, you know? right. I know it's, it's a new country. We've only been around for a couple hundred years, and people come from all over, and they combine all their cultures. And uh, But, like, for instance, I had a very American dinner tonight with my grandfather. I live with my grandfather, and uh, we cooked dinner together. Um, he made fish, like a red snapper, with, it was, like, breaded with... Uh, cornmeal, so it's red snapper, fish, and we made asparagus, it's a vegetable, I don't know if you yeah, know. Yeah. Asparagus, and I cooked some brown jasmine rice. Rice, oh. asparagus, and fish. Just, that's that's American, I guess, I don't know. Oh, sounds delicious. It was good, yeah, it was very, very good. Um, but honestly, I like to eat um, food from all over the world. I like, uh, I like ethnic food. I think it, right? Exotic. Yeah. Kind of exotic too. Have you ever tried something exotic? Like, for example, I don't know, uh, 
talking alive? <laughs> no, I haven't anything alive, but I have eaten sashimi and uh, ceviche, and uh, I've had I've had I was in Peru, and I had I had guinea pig and alpaca, and uh, I don't know I've 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 eaten some strange things. I think. You went to Peru? Yes, I did. I did go to Peru once. But it's yeah. so cheap there. What's that? Yeah. It's cheap there. Cheap? Very, very cheap. Cheap. Maybe. Interesting. Teacher, I have I have a different uh, some some question for you. Mm -hmm. uh, do you just teach in English in, in the internet or? Yeah, I, so I do yes. all my teaching online. Okay. Uh, I do some private lessons on Skype with people. They they pay me to do like an hour lesson or something, and then I do this on Colingo and stuff like that. So. Okay. Yep. Well, what else is happening? Um, I have a question with you, please. Yes. Okay, uh, why don't you tell us about the funniest situation that ever happened in your life? <laughs> For me? Yes. The funniest situation that ever happened in my life? Ah, <laughs> uh, boy. That's a hard question. I have a lot of funny things happen to me. I don't know. It's a good question. I have to be prepared for that. <laughs> <laughs> it just came up to my mind right now. Yeah, yeah. Anyone can answer. Yeah, maybe someone else can answer that question. What's the funny thing that happened to you, or somebody else in the in the class? Because I'll think, I'll try to think of something, but nothing comes to mind. It'd be exceptionally funny. Well, okay, um, that's not really funny. It's kind of sad, but it's it is kind of funny. Recently, this is not the funniest thing, but it was just kind of crazy. It's more crazy. I okay. was hanging out with my friend um, uh, a few months ago. And I was driving home from his house, and it was a thunderstorm. It was thunder and lightning, a big yes. storm. Yes. And I had forgotten to get gas in my car. I forgot to put gas in my car. And I ran out of gas on the highway. And it was very, very late at night. It was like 1 in the morning or 2 in the morning. It was very late. And so I was in the middle of the highway, and I, my car was stopped because I didn't have any gas. And it was raining and thundering and lightning, and I couldn't call anyone because everyone was asleep. So yeah. I sat there for a while and I thought about it. And finally, I got out of the car and I uh, walked home. <laughs> and I walked home in the rain and the thunder and lightning. And I was wearing not very good clothes. I had holes in my shoes, walking through water. And, oh my God, this is uh, not good. <laughs> Yeah, it's, it's not dangerous to do it. And it was a five, It was about eight kilometers. I walked in this eight kilometers. Whoa! <laughs> and then I got home around three thirty in the morning, and the next morning I had to wake up and I had to perform music in my church. So I had to wake up at like seven o'clock, and the next morning and perform music. And the theme for our for our service that morning was uh, optimism. I think optimism. You guys know what do you guys know what optimism is? No. It's like when you if you look at everything in a good way. So you can take a situation and you can think of it as bad yes. or you can look at all the good things about it, right? Yes. So you know that Yes. Like the uh, glass is half <laughs> half empty or half full. Right? The optimist thinks it's half full and the pessimist uh -huh. is half empty. So can you can, can you write this word here? I Thank just you. did. Yeah, I just wrote. I just wrote. Yeah. So. Um, but while looking at the rain, it's a horror movie for me. Yeah, it was crazy. So but I just, I just was being optimistic, just being an optimist, and I just walked home, and uh, it was it was crazy. I don't know if that's funny, but it was, it's funny to me. I guess it's kind of it's ridiculous. It's funny. It's funny. No, I was very wet. <laughs> <laughs> okay, thank you. Yes. 
Now, somebody else tell a story. Mm -hmm. um, we have a new student in the class. We can talk to him. Ivan? Yes, sir. Hello, how are you? Hello, how are you? I'm fine. Yes, and where are you from? I'm from Jakarta, in Indonesia. Oh, okay. Cool. Oh, okay. So, uh, tell me about yourself. Uh, actually, there's a little echo. Do you have an extra window open? It's kind of noisy. Make sure you don't have Very any Can you hear me? Yes, uh, listen to you well. Excuse me? Uh, I cannot listen to you very well, so can you leave it? Yeah, um, well, it just sounds like you have an extra window. Open. On your browser? On your browser. If you, can, if you can close it. If you can close it. Because there's too much echo. Because there's too much echo. Okay. okay. So tell us about yourself. Nope, he's gone. Yes. <laughs> All right. Um, Hello? Hello? Hello, teacher. Hello, Jonathan. Oh, uh, teacher, I, I have um, a doubt. The Talking question. about for the freeze of verbs, uh, the doubt that that always appears if it's actually used in the USA. Mm -hmm. Phrase of verbs? Yes, phrase of verbs. Yeah, it's, all the time. It, it, it's it's uh, actually used in the USA. Oh yes. Oh, uh, it's uh, it's part of our it's part of the English language. Yeah, it's it's a very important part of the English uh, language. Yeah, and idioms, and also everything you hear about idioms and expressions and all that, always, all the time we use idioms, expressions, phrasal verbs, all the time. It's just part of our language. Okay, it's this yeah. is a, a doubt. Thank you. Oh yes. Yeah, all the time. So yeah, I get to pick up my father-in-law from the. You know, to pick up. Yeah, I mean, that's just that is the word. That's how you say it. So you can't really escape it. Uh, English is filled with phrasal verbs. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yes. Um, people keep asking me questions, but I can ask you guys. Oh wait, we have um, Laercio. Hello, teacher. Hi. How are you? I'm fine. And you? Good. Good. How do I say your name? Uh, it's a Laersu. Oh, okay, Laersu. I think I said it right. And where are you from? I'm from Brazil. Mm -hmm. Which city? Uh, São Paulo. Mm -hmm. uh, I I study English a few a short time, a uh, uh, little more, three months, uh, two months. I work in the public hospital in São Paulo in the communication department. Okay, great. But I'm very happy for to be here. No, oh, well, happy. We're happy you're here too. Okay, thank and, you. Uh, yeah, we have classes every hour here on Cullingham, and this hour is almost over, or as we say in America, this hour is almost up. So we use the word "up" in so many different ways. So the hour is almost up. Time is up. It means time, time to go. So. Um, if there's any other things anyone wants to say, we have about 30 seconds. Um, otherwise, I will say good day or good night to you. So, but thanks, everyone, for participating. It's nice to meet everyone, and I hope to see you again in, uh, in another class. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you, teacher. See you. Thank you. All right, see you take soon. Care. Yep, see you soon. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.